100 teachers and school staffers in Daly City are starting to move into new apartments at below market rents. KPIX 5's Sharon Chin takes us inside the community that's becoming a model for the nation on affordable housing for educators. Right now, what you should be working on is your study guide for your test on Friday. When Westmore High School teacher Lisa Raskin changed careers, she knew she couldn't afford to live alone. When I decided to go back to school when I was 28 to become a teacher, I had to live with my mom and I haven't been able to leave for 10 years um, just because the rents have been so high. Now she can finally have her own place. I mean, it feels great. I mean, I feel like an adult. <laughs> You know, even though I've been an adult for a long time, this now gives me the opportunity to be on my own. The Jefferson Union High School District is renting out 122 new apartments for educators on Saramonte Boulevard at 60% of market rates. Rent starts at more than $1,300 a month for a one bedroom and more than $2,300 for a three bedroom. Really pretty. The $75.5 million construction project on the old Saramonte High School site. The district was the first in the country to pass a bond measure to fund a teacher housing project. Voters gave the okay in June 2018. With an average salary of $64,000 a year, Superintendent Tony Presta says it's been a struggle to keep employees. We are the lowest paid high school district in the county by a significant margin. Um, and because of that, we routinely lose staff. About 25% of our staff moves on every year. About 100 staff members have already reserved their new apartments. About 20 units are left. We may not be able to pay what some of our neighboring school districts can pay, but young teachers who live or are moving to the Bay Area and can't afford to live here, this is a really big recruiting tool. It's nice and it is bright. From the stainless steel appliances to the shared laundry, gym and play areas. We wanted to make sure that it felt nice. School construction director Stephanie Phillips helped create a welcome environment. I want them to feel like their home. Single mom Denise Bibiano can't wait to move in. The Jefferson High office assistant can finally move out of her parents' house and make rent without taking a second or third job. I was just amazed. It was beautiful just walking in and thinking, wow, I can actually live here. This really will be a beautiful neighborhood. Presta and says tenants can stay for five years, allowing them to save money, maybe enough to buy a home. Bye, you guys. Have a good day. For Raskin, yeah, the savings aren't just on rent. She'll also say goodbye to sky high gasoline costs since she'll be able to walk between school and her new, more affordable home. In Daly City, Sharon Chin, KPIX 5. The official ribbon cutting is Friday. The district says the apartments are phase one of a neighborhood plan that includes retail and other housing.